Hi everybody and I welcome you all to Mr. GT Online. This video is an informative update regarding a download file that you might notice when you log into GTA Online next. So there is a kind of a new update for GTA Online that means we have a new update file. You will need to install the file once you are required to play GTA Online or once you switch on your consoles. There will be an update file to be downloaded for playing GTA Online. Moreover, whenever we see an update file, we do expect something new in the game. But today is something different. We have a patch update today in GTA Online. And the update size for the file might not be much. Maximum 1 GB or 400 MB approximately. And now let's talk about what all this update has brought to in the game. So first up, this is a different update for different consoles. And all the patches related to PC, PS4 and PC or PS5 are different. So firstly, let's talk about the ps5 ps4 and the xbox and also the pc so they have fixed the issue that prevented players from being able to modify the kanjali tank the rcv and the chernobog in the facility so this is the first thing they have fixed moreover in terms of the security they have also implemented a new data protocol to improve the security network of the sessions or the public lobbies and also the player to player messaging also there are some general stability improvements to the game and also they have fixed the issue which in which we have the cars window missing reflections in some graphic mode so yes there was car windows missing in some graphics mode that has also been now fixed plus we also have some multiple crashes that occur in gt online some network crashes and all that also we have been now fixed moreover they have also fixed the issue that resulted in players being incorrectly notified that they need to complete the prologue to access GTA Online. And if you are a regular player in GTA Online, once you move to, to story mode, you might have noticed these days that it started the prologue. So you have to restart the game in order to get into story mode. So that have also been now fixed. That was a bug and it, holds, it has also been now fixed. Moving ahead, they have also fixed the issue that prevented some accounts from accessing GTA Online due to the stats having been modified by a third party. So this is also was an error that is now fixed. Lastly, they have also also fixed multiple issues resulted in some users being able to abuse text chat systems basically on the PC. So these are all the errors and games fixers or say the things that needed to be fixed in the game are now being fixed through an update file. So this is what the update was and it's officially notified by Rockstar. All the things I told you are officially now out by Rockstar. I hope you found this video informative. A like and a subscribe would be highly, highly appreciable. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.